Both the Big Sky Conference men and women are battling for an NCAA tournament bid at Idaho Central Arena in downtown Boise. My wife and I have been here all three years. It's a, it's a great, great facility, great size for the Big Sky. Uh, it's a great town, great place to walk, great place to find food, and, uh, and a great place to find beer. Two years ago, the Big Sky Conference first came to Boise, and each fan base had their own designated bar. But that seems like a distant memory. However, fans certainly remember last year. We flew in at 7 in the morning and obviously got the news not long after that uh, our game was going to be, uh, the tournament was going to be canceled. And so uh, we got to spend about three extra days just exploring the city. It's beautiful. It's clean. It's been one year since the pandemic stopped sports completely. And Eastern Washington fans were disappointed because their men's team earned the number one seed. We had high hopes to go to the tournament. Um, we had some stud seniors that you just, your heart breaks for them because their dreams essentially kind of got cut short and so um, we're just happy to be back. And they will keep coming back for the next five years as the Big Sky Conference signed a new deal to have this tournament in downtown Boise. It's a great town, it's a great place to have the Big Sky Tournament and we are uh, just so proud to be Montana State Bobcats supporters and uh, we're going to be here until the men win the championship. Both fan bases I talked to raved about the weather here in Boise. And I'm from Bozeman, where Montana State plays. I know there's still snow on the ground back there. So some of the fans told me they were really excited to come here and hit the golf course. Steve Dent, Idaho News 6.